guys, Drew here, and today I'm checking out the EVH5153. For those who don't know, uh, EVH is a series of amplifiers co-designed by Fender and Eddie Van Halen. Eddie Van Halen made famous by the band Van Halen. Um, this is the 50 watt version of the EVH5153. Uh, super, super cool all tube amplifier, full three channels. Uh, you've got your clean and rhythm channel uh, in section one here that share an EQ, and then channel three is your super gain channel. Uh, all switchable on the panel or foot switchable with a uh, foot switch that comes with the amplifier. On the foot switch, as you can see, there is a one, two, and three button and an effects loop button. Uh, you can turn on and off your effects loop um, and switch between the three channels. So again, your back panel, very straightforward layout. It's got this cool uh, binder uh, so you can coil up your uh, power cable, your power cable input, your uh, receptacle for your fuse, power on, your standby, there's a headphone output jack. Uh, you've got a MIDI in, so if you're running a system with a Control 1 or uh, any system that runs any MIDI effects or MIDI controllers, you can control the snaps, foot switching, and so on and so forth with the MIDI input jack, your standard foot switch jack, your effects loop send and return, your preamp out, which is uh, pre-power amp, your resonance control, your ohm selector for your speaker cabinets you can switch between 4 8 and 16 ohms and your two speaker outputs let's start in the clean channel with the settings the way you see them gain at about uh, two o'clock your low at about uh, nine the mids at halfway the high at halfway and the volume is just just below one um, i have this set up mic'd up today with a PVM on the lower right hand cone and an SM57 on the upper right hand cone uh, going through a Marshall Greenback cabinet uh, direct into Pro Tools uh, and we're checking this out today with a Stefelen Zephyr uh, this guitar features a mahogany one piece neck with a rosewood fingerboard Wilkinson keys a Shaler locking uh, Floyd Rose style bridge Four Seasons humbuckers um, a single volume, a single tone, and we're going to go through the three channels starting with the clean. <laughs> So let's move on to the rhythm channel. Again, with the settings the way you see them, haven't changed anything. Add a little bit more gain. As you can hear, the app is a super, super articulate, clean and rhythm channel. As you uh, progress to the uh, heavy gain channel, you'll see that you can get to uh, the heaviest of heavy tones out of it. There are metal players that use this amp as a mainstay and, you know, guys that play, uh, you know, blues and, uh, you know, lighter rock music. Uh, it's an extremely versatile amplifier and for the money it's worth checking out. Um, let's move on to the uh, heavy gain channel. Gain on the heavy gain channel right now is it uh, just a little bit backed off from half, low at almost full, uh, mids it just backed off from half, highs at half, and again the volume just below one. Thank <laughs> you. 
Let's raise the gain a little bit. So as high gain as this amp is, even in channel 3, uh, you still have articulation, uh, you can hear the clarity in the notes. So in conclusion, you get a really good sense of, uh, of how this amp sounds. Uh, it's very articulate, uh, a whole lot less noise than the uh, predecessors of the 5150. Um, cool little package, not super heavy. Um, uh, great foot switch layout. Uh, great back panel layout. The effects loop is very clean. Uh, I didn't have any issues with any serious tone change. Um, overall, I really dig this amp. It's really, really cool. I suggest you check it out. For full interviews, live footage, and other features, go to our website at laguitars.com or visit our YouTube channel at laguitars.